Hey everyone, good morning. Just thought I'd uh, do another quick uh, review of what we've done so far. I'm going to invite my friend Laura into this. Oops, there we go, Laura. So if you've been watching, thank you for watching. And we have, uh, we've had a lot of good people, uh, a lot of good comments from people messaging us privately, which is uh, interesting. But a lot of people are into, uh, a lot of people are having sleep issues. So uh, there's Laura. Let's see if she's coming in. Okay. There you come. Hey, Laura. Good morning. Hey there. Good morning. All right. So I was just uh, going to do a quick uh, review of what we've done so far and, and let you get into uh, the nurturing, the more having nature nurture us. Um, so anyway, we re read that sleep is the number one medical complaint that people have, which is crazy. The number one. And so and we know that poor sleep, lack of sleep can affect uh, memory issues, mood, weakened immunity, um, trouble with thinking and concentrating, accidents, uh, high blood pressure, weight gain. Weight gain, is a, uh, that should be a number one reason that people want to um, get better sleep, right? Mm -hmm. uh, risk for diabetes is increased. It lowers your sex drive. That's another reason. Risk of he heart disease and poor balance. So these are things that just can come from not getting enough sleep. And we've talked about the endocannabinoid system and how that can, if we address the endocannabinoid system uh, with exogenous cannabinoids like CBD oil, how that can help your body uh, sleep better, rest and function better. So there's more to the CBD plant than just the CBD oil. So why don't you uh, uh, talk about that? Yeah, you know, it's really fascinating because I used to think before I knew what I knew, I used to think, okay, well, CBD oil, it's just CBD, right? And so um, not me all too. oil is the same, but you know, what's really fascinating to me is that a lot of times you'll see CBD out there, hemp oil, when you look at the labeling. And so CBD comes from the hemp plant, right? And it's the most abundant compound in the hemp plant. And so that's where you get all the rage and you hear about the CBD, but there are so many other beneficial things in the hemp plant for our health, which is incredible. So again, CBD has, it's like a huge part of the plant, but there's also flavonoids and terpenes and all kinds of other stuff in that plant. And terpenes are amazing because they're almost like the essential oils in, in a way, because they give the plant the smells and the tastes and things like that. So it's not just CBD oil. When you're taking CBD oil, if it says straight up CBD isolate, then it's just CBD oil. So, and that's an educational thing that I didn't know. So I know a, a lot of folks out there probably don't know that as well. But Most people. Yeah. So the main, the, I guess the point I'm trying to make is that it's, there's so much in that hemp plant that can benefit our health. You know, they we talk about plant-based, you see plant-based everything. And so it's truly the whole plant that is benefiting us in so many different ways. So when you think about a terpene, you're thinking about, you know, the smell of lavender, you know, how lavender can help you sleep. Well, that's kind of comes from a terpene in a plant. So um, we're, I'm excited to share a little bit more about some of the terpene stuff that I use. Um, but I just thought it was really important that people understood that there's just more to the hemp plant than CBD. Yeah, um, I think maybe even go in a little bit, like uh, the terpenes. Uh, so I know from what I've learned, the terpenes are like what gives it that uh, fragrance. Like if you mm -hmm. think of what, if you just think about a lemon, you could think of what it smells like. Mm -hmm. um, that's how our brain is associated, right? But that the fragrance of the lemon is it the terpene in the lemon mm -hmm. or the or the lavender that you talked about smelling the lavender that's the terpene in there so these are things but they have uh so essential oils come they come from terpenes too so a lot of people are in the uh, essential oils and there's a lot of health benefits from um uh, essential oils so when you're getting the whole plant you're getting all of those benefits so um that's that's the importance of the terpenes to me um mm -hmm and then how the body can process it. And we can really do a lot of uh, good, And but there's specific ones that are gonna help us uh, with the CBD, with the, um, the hemp plant has its own terpenes, which lemon has its own terpene, lavender has its own terpene, right? 
Mm -hmm. am, I, mm -hmm. am I on target with that? You are on target. Absolutely. It's fat. I mean, it's a really fascinating plant. And so what I'm really excited to talk about is when we look at, you know, in our next video and please share more if you have to share more this morning, but what I really am so excited to talk about in our next video is when you look at all this stuff out there, you see all these different things on the market. Like we were talking about, I just thought it was just CBD straight up. So we're going to look at when you're like, okay, well, I think I need more sleep. I might want to try some things. What do I try? There's stuff everywhere. And so what we're really excited to talk about is specific things that you can help narrow your focus in. What do I need to take to help me specifically sleep better so I can manage my weight better, so I can have focus during the day, so I can be patient, right? <laughs> so I don't have that. Um, what do we call it? The um, after evening hangover when you're taking drugs that can kind of help you. Right, sleep right. At night, but then you feel like, you know, lethargic in the morning. So you can just feel rested and renewed and revived in the morning. So I'm really excited to talk about that. Uh, and, you know, I thought maybe uh, just to recap, we had a lot of good tips this week of things to do to help you sleep uh, in addition to uh, taking uh, CBD oil is um, turning off the TV, right? Yeah. Uh, keeping a notebook by the bed. So if your brain is running, 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 and you can't, it, it, you know what I just, um, CBD actually helps with, if you have one of those brains that like you're trying to fall asleep, but you're like, oh, did I lock the door? Did I, oh, tomorrow I need to buy milk or, and your brain just runs through that list of things. It's that, mm -hmm. that squirrely brain that just keeps going through. Mm -hmm. That's what CBD actually helps the mind calm down so you can mm -hmm. focus better and you're not having that. Oh, like a lot of people, I didn't realize how many people have struggle with that, that, you know, when they're trying to rest and they're like, wait a minute, I need to, um, did I make the lunches? Did I do this? Is the door locked? Is this, you know, and they go through this whole thing and they can't fall asleep. Mm -hmm. the, uh, I find that amazing that this is such nature can help you um, without drugs find that peace so you can rest. I, I, it's just amazing to me. So uh, I think keeping a notebook by the bed uh, is a great idea. I, I advise all my Reiki clients to keep a notebook by the bed because if you can't turn off your brain, you just, I think of the writing with a pen is like um, downloading like software mm -hmm. like, and it, it helps if you have a computer virus going through you the pen is the magic in helping you heal mm -hmm. so uh and just writing it down but you know if you need help calming your body down and helping the focus something natural from nature is uh, beautiful to me uh another tip you had was um oh i forget it just went out of my head <laughs> that's okay you know and i'll comment on um if you can remember it while i'm talking um my husband is exactly what you talked about. So, you know, I oftentimes I'll categorize it as a like, oh, women. We always have these racing thoughts, you know, because that's how we think. We think in circles. But my husband has those racing thoughts. And I will be honest, he is probably the last person to use CBD, right? But he reluctantly tried it. Um, and when he ran out, he was like, I need some more of that because I'm finally sleeping. And so right. it makes I mean, a difference. Was, yeah. Years with, with, um, getting up every single night just due to his racing thoughts that he had. So I'm glad you mentioned that because I'm living with, with that. Like, <laughs> yeah. I, I think a lot of people now. do. I think a lot of people do. So, uh, I, I was just, you know, I, I love to learn as much as I can. And I realized that that was something I was listening to uh, Dr. Jack actually, and he was going over that. I was like, oh, how about that? A lot of people do, I do hear a lot of people saying that and I never really realized that, you know, the plant can really help you uh, just calm the brain so you don't have all those uh, thoughts going all over the place. And so it could help your brain. And, you know, I, I had ADD, I took medicine for that, which was awful. I don't recommend putting people on medicine that I had to take and because it's hard to get off of it. Um, so I feel so much better and more focused just from using CBD. So that's how it's helped me. Mm -hmm. So do you want to wrap it up for today? Yeah. So I appreciate everybody watching. If you have, we're still, we're collecting all the people that are sending us messages and commenting. So uh, if you have any questions or if you're using anything that's helping you, if you have great sleep tips, please share it. 
and then we're going to have a little raffle and have a little gift for whoever's been uh, uh, most vocal. And uh, so if you have any questions, please, you can feel free to message us privately so you don't have to ask your question uh, on Facebook. Uh, but um, <laughs> any way we can help, we would, we would love to help you. Thank you so much. And I always enjoy talking with you, Donna. And oh, it's back you at know, you. We just hope that you all are taking just a little bit away because that's our goal is to kind of serve and just bring value. So everyone have a fantastic Saturday. Right. Thanks, everyone. See you later, Laura. Bye-bye.